Texas. Do you miss Texas food? Yes. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Today at 2 on NBC4. Welcome back to California Live. We've all heard of dentists and orthodontists, but have you ever heard of an endodontist? These are the people who specialize in root canals to try and save our natural teeth. And believe it or not, 81% of Americans wish they'd taken better care of their natural teeth. Here to give us some tips on how we can take better care of our teeth is Dr. Stefan Zweig, the president of the American Association of Endodontists. Hello, doctor. Nice to see you, Jess. Nice, nice to be to here. Thank you so much. I needed you 10 years ago when I had my root canal. So for the fo yeah. fortunate folks at home who have no idea what that is, please explain what a root canal is. Well, root canals are procedures that's designed to save a tooth that has either that's either inflamed or infected. And when it's inflamed and infected, it can be painful. So not only does the root canal save your tooth, but it also removes the pain. Amazing. Okay, so I know it's very important to get regular checkups but sometimes we skip a few, things get, you know, life gets in the way. How do we know when it's time to see an endodontist? Well, generally speaking, when you have pain with a tooth, you're probably gonna end up needing a root canal, and if you need a root canal, you should see an endodontist, because an endodontist is a specialist in doing root canal. Okay, so what if we have a chipped tooth, maybe a little bit of pain, do we just go see a dentist first, or what, what do we do in that situation? What's our first step? I mean, generally, you're going to want to see your general dentist, but if you have pain, you're probably going to end up at an endodontist. Mm -hmm. So you can also refer yourself to an endodontist if you have pain and you think you might need a root canal. Oh, great. Okay, so obviously, regular checkups, we all want to do that. What are some preventative uh, tips that we can do to save our teeth? Well, of course, you're going to want to brush your teeth daily and floss daily. Okay. Um, and you're going to want to take care of yourself in terms of if you participate in sports, you're going to want to avoid any kind of trauma and wear mouth guard. Or if you grind your teeth, you may want to wear something called a night guard, which uh, helps you at night to not grind your teeth. So this is a, a question. How do you know you grind your teeth, especially if you live alone? Uh, it's, it's hard. <laughs> like, I always <laughs> um, wonder. if generally, you know, you could wake up with like soreness of your jaw, the muscles oh. of your jaw, or you may have some like sensitivity of your teeth. Okay. Um, so if you think you're grinding, uh, you should talk to your dentist because they may be able to see the, the, the results of your grinding. Good to know. Thank you so much, doctor. And for more information or to find an endodontist in your area, go to findmyendodontist.com. Are you ready to make junk disappear? I've never been more ready in my life. We make junk disappear. All you have to do is point. <laughs> Call 1-800-GOT-JUNK. We'll be there before you hang up the phone. Do you need a...